so the Mennonites, I think they're kind of, they have their own little community that they live in. They're not Amish, and I'm like at all because they have they like have technology they use it they you know drive cars and things like that um they're really religious that's the coolest thing about because in their store we walked in there and there's like all this stuff about christ and like they had like um, cds that you could buy with like people singing about christ and things like that so that was really neat and i think they just live a, sim a better simpler life because they're more set apart and they're more paying attention to I, not paying attention so much to the world as to where I think sometimes we get really mixed up in it and it makes things really bad. So th I think that's a little more pure life, I guess, <laughs> I would say. So in um, Mexico, Missouri, so just right out of side of our area, there was a place called Amish Town and like you could go there and buy fresh fruits and things like that. So like all the Amish people lived out on their own property, their own land. And it was um, really neat because we had a Remember that she'd go out there all the time and go and buy things, and she said that she saw these two little kids sitting on their grass, and they were like in their clothes, and they were like, she like they were so cute. She like I was just taking pictures of them, but she's like I don't know if that would like offend them or something. She like but they were adorable. <laughs> it was just really funny. <laughs> they had people who would just like go and grab them from their town and bring them in to go to Walmart or something, and so it was just really it was really neat to see like the community helping the Amish people and be like okay like you need to go to the store like let's hop in and we'll go to the store because they use a cart and buggy and they they need faster uh, transportation so like a truck or a car was the like best thing for them I guess to go to the store.